Hey, my name's Craig. I'm here at Private Fairway, and I'm going to, uh, over the winter, I'm going to try to play all the golf courses that are available in the TrackMan uh, golf simulator system. So, I'm going to start with Muirfield Village. This is a course that I've played in real life, but it was a course I played before they made the changes to it. So, uh, we're just going to tee it up and play it straight up and see how we do. And I thought you might be interested to see kind of how the TrackMan works and uh, and how real the golf really is. Well, a little bit, right? This one is a little bit of an uphill lie and that will affect the ball. So we'll just kind of factor that in. Oops. Not too bad. Okay. You can actually putt on the track man. So we have a 62 foot putt that's uphill, 11 inches. That little tracer is showing me what the break is. So I just have to hit at the right speed, the right, as straight as I can, the right speed. It's gonna be short. Well, not too bad. There we go. Start off, that's not bad. Oh, here, let's turn the, uh, let's turn the drone intros off. It'll go a little quicker. All right. Number two. Leaving the club face open. 99 yards. For me, that's going to be All right. Thirty three feet. Just short, but it's inside the gimme. Two bad drives, two pars, so not bad. We'll take it. All right, we'll change the club here. This hole's a little tricky because there's a lake down there. If you're wondering what that rainbow grid is, that's just showing me my lie, right? So it's a little tiny bit uphill, but pretty flat. Oh, be enough, it might be short. Oh, nope, good. All right, Let's see if we can 
Get it inside that gimme circle for another bar. Oh, just barely. That was not the best pot. <sighs> okay, in real life, when I played this hole, I hit it right in that bunker, right there. And then believe it or not, I chipped out and it rolled in for a birdie. I know that's hard to believe, but it actually happened. All right. What is it telling me? I think I'm going to change that. Oh, I might be in that sand trap again. Short of the sand trap. All right. The green slopes red to blue, so we'll aim out just a little. Let's see what we can do. Oh, come on. All right, I have to make this putter. It's going to be the first bogey. Always has to be a first, I guess. Oh, stop, stop, stop. <sighs> All right, this is a tricky part five because you kind of have to lay up. And there's actually a creek right there. And unless you can get it over that creek, you're kind of in a bad way. So I think we'll just lay up. If you want, we can see what it looks like. So I kind of fly up here, like a little fly over. So see, there's that creek that runs right through the fairway. And then he has kind of a split fairway. So. 240 will be just about right. Oh, come on. Or we could hit it in the trees. That's bad. All right, let's see what we can do. See if we can thread it through there. Nope. But maybe, oh, it hit the tree. What a lousy swing. Must still be rolling a little bit. Oh my gosh. In a bad way. Oh, not too bad. Oh gosh. I have to lay up. Well, in real life, I made a mess out of this hole too, so it's not unusual. All right, let's see.
Go in. Oh! There we go. All right. Get that one out of the way. Here we have a nice little part four. Should be able to hit driver. The courses all play at their real elevation. So if you're gonna play, you'll see that the the actual yardage is a little, I live in Utah, so I'm used to hitting a little further. Fuck it. I'm all over the place. All right. Nasty little downhill live. We have 90% power. Aim a little bit to the left. A little open club face. A little short on the fringe. So, see if we can chip it inside that gimme circle. That'd be nice. Get up there. Nope. All right, Craig. See if you can save another one. That'd be nice. Nope, just short. Two bogeys. All right. Number seven. Hmm. Down to the corner. Let's see if we can hit one straight this time. Hmm, I don't like that. Let's see. All right. Here we go. Hey, in the fairway. It's about time. Part five, 248. Let's see what we can do. It's going to be short. Get inside there. Hey, look at that. Inside the gimme circle. Seven foot putt, I know is pretty generous, but. All right. 39. Okay. Don't be short. Not bad. A little short, but I was in the sand trap on the left in real life. So let's see what we got here. 42 feet. All right, not bad. A 
at the Memorial Tournament a couple of years ago. I watched Tiger Woods play from about right there where that 264 marker is. Of course, he was playing back a little further at the Memorial Tees. But we'll see what we can do. It's going to be right. Hey, Craig. Hit the tree. It's bouncing in the tree. Well, I also saw Bubba play from right about here. That same, maybe it was a different year. I've been to the memorial a couple times. Oh, it hit that tree, I think. Dang it. All right, so in the track man, when you hit it in the hazard, just like real life, you have to take a drop. Tells you what your options are. So we'll drop it there. See if we can salvage something not too nasty. Let's see. It's going to be left. Whoa, way too far. Come on back. All right. Well, it looks like now we're going to have our first double buggy of the day, perhaps. Guess we can make this pop. Well, that's a good pop. Don't go out. Dang it. That was a pretty good putt. Get in there. Short. Triple bogey. Well, that's no good. All right, we played nine holes. So nine holes pretty quick. First front nine at Muirfield Village. Uh, let's look at the score. We are currently four over. So four over gross. I have a five handicap on the track man. So it's giving me just plus one. So uh, I have a 13.8 USGA handicap. So you play significantly better when you play on the track inside. Gosh, everything's just a little bit right today. Let's see if we can work on that. some ground here now it's get inside there please there we go not bad you got a par that was an ugly par this hole is a fun hole in fact, let's do a little flyover just so you can see it. So this is from the very back tee. So when they play at the Memorial, they play it like this and everything kind of slopes down to that creek on the left. And uh, the pros usually around these sand traps there, a little bit past maybe. And then you can either go for it to the green or if you're a mere mortal, we lay up. Craig, you and the trees today. 
leaving that club face a little bit open. Two fifty-three to the flag. We could lay up down in here somewhere. Probably smart. We lay up somewhere like that, maybe. Get in there. Oh, that would have been nice, wouldn't it have been? All right, let's see. A 10 foot putt for birdie. Be nice to be fun to make that. Let's see, make a putt, like not a gimme birdie, but a real birdie. All right, let's see. Oh, birdie. Nice. One twenty eight. Okay. This is a fun hole to dial up in the TrackMan software and just practice on. You can just hit the tee shot over and over. It's going to be left. Just be enough. Oh, over. Sands a little bit. You don't really play out of the sand. It's just like a little chip, but it will affect your distance. So see down there on the bottom, right? It says I have 68% power. Ah. All right. So. Pros on this hole, they kind of go for it down here over the over the trees like that. And uh, since we're hitting everything to the right, I got nothing to lose by trying that. Wow, it's a good thing I aimed way left, huh? All right. So let's see what we got. Okay. Oh, Craig, hung it out. Is he going to get on? Nope. Oh, look at that. Barely inside. You give me range. Oh, let's see. This is another one where it can be a little tricky. I haven't really been hitting the ball particularly great. So, I think we'll try to be smart here. Uh-oh. Don't go in the creek, please. Oh, I hit that tree. Well, that was lucky. All right. 152. I think that's 
going to be a seven at this altitude. Left it open again in the creek. In the creek. Left the face of the club open in the creek. All right. We'll take a drop. Oh my gosh, lazy swing. That was horrible. All right, well, we've all been there, right? It's just like real golf, unfortunately. All right, hit that shot again. Hopefully not do the same thing. I wasn't gonna do it, was I? Oh my heavens. Blow up ball. All those lucky gimme circles are coming back to haunt me. All right. Get in there. Stop, please. There we go. Well, what's that? Another triple? Or worse, maybe, right? Let's see. Quadruple bogey. Ugh. All right. 15. This one they actually changed quite a bit. It's a lot uphill. If I remember right. See if we can hit the driver straight. Come on, Craig. Nope. Well, that's a little bit straight. 27 feet. <laughs> Up the middle, I'll take that. That's pretty good considering what we've been hitting. Eighteen feet uphill, two hundred fifteen yards. All right, it's saying five hybrid, but I think it's three hybrid. We'll see who's smarter, me or the track man. Oh, the track man. Definitely. Oh my gosh. What a bad swing. Uh, let's see, what are our options here? Probably that one. Wow, Craig. Ruin your best drive. All right, let's see. Uh, not too bad. Oh, wow, it came out kind of bad. All right, let's see. Came out lower than I thought that would. Eighteen feet for a bogey. Ah, oh, it's gonna be short. It's gonna be short. It's gonna be short. So. One fifty three. All right. that right and it's 
making life worse. Oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man. Officially blowing up. Officially blowing up. All right. Let's just try to get out of here without too much more embarrassment. It's in the sand. Oh my gosh. Nope, it's not going to get in there. My luck has run out on the gimmies. My luck has run out on the gimmies. Alright. Oh, now it's going to... Alright, well... What's that? Oh, another quadruple. Two quads and a triple. And a double, so... That's a score wrecker, isn't it? All right, two holes left. Let's see if we can just finish up. Leaving it open. It's like okay. Hmm. All right. Let's try out here. No, it's gonna be over the trees though. But it's not in the right. A little short. Oh, is it in the water again? Oh my gosh. The creeks are killing me. Oh. Here we go. 72 yards. Twenty-eight feet. Oh, it's blasting past, blasting, blasting. Way downhill. Didn't pay attention. Wow. All right. Oh my gosh. One more. Jack Nicholas is laughing at me now. All right, let's see. Oh, well, that was sweet. Two quadruples in a row. All right, let's see. Last hole. Let's see if we can finish on some semblance of a decent note on number 18. All right. Come on. Hey, look at that. Right where I wanted to go. Right where I aimed. Right on that little circle. All right. Well, there's no creek. Let's see if I can take out that Rolex clock on the clubhouse. All right. Woo, it's hanging on by its 
fingernails. All right. Let's see. I watched uh, Patrick Cantlay and Hideki Matsuyama win right on this one. I am not going to win. We'll see. Not bad. Well, that's not going to help my track man handicap any. So I shot 90 for a net 84. So that's, uh, that's Mirfield Village in the track man. Uh, find yourself a track man somewhere. If you're in Utah, come see us at Private Fairway and we'll hook you up.